gigs at least, one for the server operating system, your quote unquote host operating system, and then you should also have a separate hard drive for your virtual machine hard drive files, for your VHD files like I was talking with you about earlier. This way, let's say that your operating system, your host operating system completely tanks. All right, so if your server OS hard drive dies, don't worry too much about it. You can take out the hard drive that contains your VHD files, put it into another Server 2008 machine, and 